Oh yeah, sexy biscuits. Nice. Long black clothes, 1970. This is Thunderfox by Tato, released in the arcades in 1990. Uh, basically, the year is 1990X. I'm going to read what it says here. Oh, look, check it out. Okay, that's kind of cool. Obviously, a simultaneous two player if you want. Anti terrorism team! Apparently they aren't equipped with shirts. Anyway, in the year 1990X, the world um, was lost in a vortex of terror. Malicious terrorism gripped the land. Not the world, the land. Uh, the sky and the sea. The land, the sky and the sea. Malicious terrorism gripped the land, the sky and the sea. Ah, because look, you're on the sea. And I think there are uh, horizontal shooting stages as well as horizontal running in stabby, stabby uh, stages. There were two brave men who fought against the reign of violence. They were the anti-terrorism team, Thunder Fox. Know nothing of this game other than it just showed up, uh, well it didn't just show up, it's been there for about four years. I found it in the list of ROMs in Quinups 8 on uh, my modded OG Xbox. Not like the intro. And it reminded me of uh, Ninja Warriors. Although I know nothing about the arcade. Stage one, break through the enemy's front line. Right, so. Right, yeah, this is why I mean it reminds you of Ninja Warriors. Look at that. Oh, okay, that's a bit different. Listen to the, the scream. Okay, immediately, as a kid, I've got to jump. I would have lost my shit over this. Right, so I've got health, which is top left. Well, no, top left is my score and shit. Go on. Flamethrower. That's lightning. Oh, that was on me. Oh! Okay. You got your Shinobi double tier system. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Now, the thing is, you've got a separate button for your fire. If you use your regular fire when you've got a gun, you twat them with your barrel stock. Stock? Barrel stock. I don't know. You know what I mean. The end of your gun. Then you got jump. And then down and jump. Okay, that's a cheap death. That's a cheap attack. Uh, yeah, down and jump, obviously, tier system. I'm off with this. This is genuinely my first time playing it. I do not like having to use a separate button. Oh, fuck. Fire. That's just awkward. Grenades. Car. <laughs> That's a bit crap, really, isn't it? Still, you know, points for mixing up. You know, the variation. I do like the parallax. Again, right, so tap, jump. Oh, I've got flying kick. I have a feeling. You have to press both buttons for that, now that will come in handy. And then, again, yeah, it's redundant until you get a gun, but a separate button for fire. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit. Did anyone actually play this back in the day? Is this not a common arcade machine? It doesn't mess around with, like, mixing it up with, like, you know, the enemy types and stuff like that. I may have killed him by landing on him. Destroy tank. This does not bode well. Okay, that is clearly from uh, Ninja Warriors. I had one grenade. Am I even damaging it? No, you get one grenade. Right, 
So, hit the bloke. I do not like these controls. I'm not getting on with these controls. Get the grenade, get off the tank. Don't miss. Rookie mistake, Dave. The only thing that's cool, I would say, is you don't have to waste your uh, your grenade. You can obviously you can save it until you get shot to take out the tank, but you can take the other people out with your knife, and then do what I do, which is immediately forget the button. Oh, look, that worked, didn't it? Right, get a grenade. You know, I cannot fulfill. If we did it, what, what's such a butter fingers with your nades? Um, everything will be fine. Well, for you, not me. Okay, that's cool. There's another one there because obviously it's simultaneous two-player. Couldn't take it away. Surely it must know it's just one of me playing this. Okay, cool. Obviously there are no home ports of this. And this is one on the sharp whatever it is. You know what I mean, like Japan only PC thing. Wouldn't have been too difficult before. Obviously it would have been slimmed down, stripped down a bit, stuff like that. But oh, I've got Ultra Fire. And here's me using my thumb like a chump. I've still got health, which is good. More shoot up, side chomp shoot up should have health. I've just decided that. Some of this in your life. Listen to the music. Electro flute. So I got. Both fire buttons do the same. Hey! Oh, look. Smokey Joe limping in. So we're on like some sort of heli carrier. Oh! Okay, that's cool. I just sat there like a plum waiting for me to like, you know, climb out and stuff. Okay, I like that. That's kind of cool. Obviously, um, I can't shoot behind me. So point for the fact that... It really is trying to mix things up. I haven't... Oh! Rapid fire. Oh no. It must be cold up there without a shirt. Apparently, wearing a shirt inhibits your ability to uh, fight terrorism. It must do. Look at Rumble 3. Oh! Because look, I got, I got unlimited pocket money. There we go. That's the weirdest boss ever. Is that really a boss? Oh, go down here. Yay! Right to left. Scotland's a bit iffy. That might be going up to eight. Am I going out the door? I press, I press fire backwards then, sorry. So presumably I wait for the door to shut. Yeah, nice touch, I like that. I like it a lot. Ooh, not today. No. Oh, I don't, I don't. Oh, bollocks, I meant to jump. Run. I don't want to go up, do I? Am I supposed to do something with those? I forgot about my amazing flying kick. Look at it. Warning. Is that? Sounds enough. I don't know. Put some money in. This is my tactic. Shirt this terrorism fighter for freedom. Yay! I'm really not sure how I even did that. Oh, escape time. Do you know what? I have to say, you know, it's it is what it is. It's an arcade machine with it's, it's just it's a well, I don't know. I wouldn't say master of all trades, but it's mixing things up. I like that. 
He's trying to be a little bit different, I guess, stand out from the crowd. Yeah, I would have been all over this as a kid. Am I getting back on my broken air bike? Oh no, go on air. Okay, yeah. I mean, seriously, did anyone did the, well, I don't know. Well, this is a perfectly English port, isn't it? So it can't be, I didn't read the thing at the start where it says that it's Japanese or not. Oh, fuck. See, sometimes you feel like they're just not going to, you know, suck you in, and other times it, well, sucks you in. I did all this by just, yay! I want the red one. So it clashes with my trousers. I did all this just by hitting two little metal things in the face. Well. There you go. Oh, no, hang on. I can't move around. And I've got to jump. He thinks it's navy moves. Oops. I just dropped him in the water. You just killed your own blokes. I mean, I know they're scubas, but... Well, there you go. Thunder Fox, never knew this was a thing. Would have quite liked it in the arcades back in the day just because it mixes stuff up. It doesn't do each particular stage, each particular stage better than other games devoted purely to that type of game. But at least you get a whole bunch of stuff in there and you get to fight terrorism. Without a shirt, everybody wins. Anyways, I'd love to know what you think. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you later.